Please, internet. Please, stay with me. Is it weird that one emote on Twitch is named Tijan and on Discord you see not? Wait, oh uh, yeah, it's because to me it's a nodding emote, but people wanted me to call it Jam on Twitch. <clears throat> when it was introduced, that's what people uh, prefer to have, but I also wanted it to be Nod still somewhere, so that's why it's Nod on Discord. Hi, my internet connection is horrible. Don't worry, it's it's the case for me too. We are matching. <laughs> Goodness. <clears throat> Hello, everyone. Uh, I actually hear nothing. Okay. Let me increase the volume a bit because I am deaf today. Okay, this is better. <clears throat> Hello, hello, hello everyone. Why? Voli, happy seven month. What the hell? This is so weird, Voli. I thought you were like there for like a shorter time. Like, it's so weird. Wow, 60 streams. It's so strange, but that's impressive. Thank you for the seven months. Wow, time flies. I was scared I said like a random emote no one's seen and hope someone will understand the word. Sometimes I type like imaginary emotes and I just I'm expecting people to imagine it. <clears throat> Damn, you think you're like a random Yeah, welcome to the stream! I know it's your first time in the chat today, but I hope you have a nice time here with us, Bully Blues. Welcome. Uh Roxy says I'm sending my hello to the people on Twitch. Wow, how, how, how kind, how polite. <laughs> Thank you for saying hello to everyone. Let me move here. Here, 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 here. here. Perfect. I don't know if it's perfect, but... Okay, um... Let me adjust the volume a bit. Saying hello's back. Yay! It's like communication across the platforms. Perfect. Also, let me say hi to everyone, so I don't forget. Ooh, let me make an account on Twitch. Uh, I think... I think... I think you shouldn't. Because I remember the age you mentioned you are at, and I think... I think you need to be older to join the platform. So yeah. Oh, but thank you for your interest still. <sighs> okay, um, 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 what was I trying to say? Yes, I wanted to say hi to everyone. So, uh, I have no idea when Kyle came to the chat at first, but I saw that he left a message very early. There's a young comment now. Yeah, I tried to add a, a, a counter for it. <laughs> We need to remember that it exists though. But yeah, welcome Kai, welcome Vistarnian. Thank you again for the, uh, how many months has it been? 13? 14? 13, I think. Yeah, 13 months, thank you. Welcome Ryan, welcome Alex, welcome Metal. <clears throat> I couldn't believe the last stream was 14 years ago. Oh my God, but despite, despite this long time, you, you, you remembered me. Yeah. Bully, welcome! Serenity, welcome! Gaming Knight, welcome! E e e Stones? I don't know how to pronounce that, but welcome! Feel free to let me know how to pronounce the name. Uh, Hugo, welcome! Pokudu, welcome! And goodbye! Uh, Okabe Critical, welcome! <sighs> Alinsky, welcome! Um, Rosie, welcome. Uh, Voli, again, thank you for the seven month. And, 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 please, welcome. And Aina, welcome. I go for dinner, yummy cheesecake. Ooh, enjoy. Bye bye. Thank you for passing by. Uh, pet the Luna chain revive. Oh, the chain in the way that people spam it. <laughs> Oh goodness. Uh, yeah, 
I, I, I hope I said hi to everyone. Uh, hello to people lurking. Hello to people watching the VOD for some obscure reason. Hello. Hello, Huey, and hello to hello, Moonsters. I feel like I'm not really used to call people like anything. Like, I just say, like, hi guys, but I kind of don't like it. But at the same time, I don't really say hi chat. And I feel like I should get the habit of like saying hi monsters or something because it's the community name. But then I keep forgetting about it. <clears throat> Lurkers and VOD watchers feeling cold out. Why cold out? It's not like a bad thing. It's more like I you know let the people too and I, I thank them for the support. I didn't get accepted. Yeah, I think actually I wouldn't be able to uh, even accept you in my chat because I know that uh, it can't work with you to be on Twitch for the time being. So I don't want to encourage it. So I wouldn't be able to let that happen. But it's, I thank you for your interest in communicating with people. I'll try to relay messages sometimes. <laughs> but yeah. Hope everyone's been well. My model is kind of like struggling as always just a normal monday afternoon i was supposed to stream in the morning but today i had to bring like my pet to the vet because it was time for the vaccine and holy crap my cat like <laughs> i have like some bite marks because my cat is so difficult at the vet like i swear like they usually have to be like several people at the vet to hold the cat to like do like blood test or do the vaccine or anything like it's so hard like sometimes they have to like get huge gloves because she's scratching them like crazy <clears throat> average cat moment so true but then like she honestly like i didn't even mind the fact that she was biting me though because like it felt like i don't know like maybe i'm delusional but she did hurt the others and in my case like i do have a few biting marks but it's not really strong like i didn't even bleed and like it just felt like she had to bite something and my hand happened to be there so i was like you know what you can do it it's fine if, if it helps you you can you can bite my hand <clears throat> i have less delay on youtube i think maybe wait there's less delay on youtube than on twitch even when you refresh i think that's an issue because <laughs> i think twitch twitch like the twitch rule for multi-streaming is like twitch quality has to be better than youtube so if youtube has a better delay i hope twitch is not gonna be like it's 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 your fault and then yeah what species of cat do you have if you want to share it's not really a species like it's just a stray cat that i adopted a long time ago I don't really like i'm guessing you meant like breed or something i can tell the uh, like the fur is like she's she's a calico so she's like you know like white orange and black but yeah uh the orange breed of cat <laughs> yeah she's very cute and she's pretty short actually she's like shorter than the average cat but she's like she's, she's like 14 she's gonna be 14 this year so it's not like she's a baby cat i mean you know she's like or baby but she's not like actually young she's like a, an old lady technically but i keep forgetting like i feel like she looks younger because she's a short cat she doesn't have like short legs in the, the way that she's not like you know like I know there are some breeds that have like really tiny legs. That's it's not to that extent, but she looks she's she's small, I guess. Oh, oh my, oh my god. Uh, um, Nyaten. Thank you for the raid. Welcome raiders. Welcome, welcome. Let me give you the shout out that you deserve. Uh, Nyaten, I. <clears throat> A color combination for cats is called turtle pinto in my language. There is like in in my language is also, I mean there's also the tortoise, tor tor tortoise, tor 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 tortoise shell, but it's referring to I think a different thing because usually calico are like primarily white with some 
orange and black but usually tortoise shells are like primarily black i think with some uh orange and stuff also let me say hi to everyone that joined today uh asya vohu and yaten and tripolis and Meowmer. welcome thank you so much for taking part of the stream i hope you had a nice one i gave you the shout out and i didn't see what you were doing you were doing art Ooh, what kind of artwork were you working on welcome readers i'm luna c hilly i'm an art streamer uh i usually draw on stream but nowadays i do uh chat at the beginning so this is still the chatting portion but we're gonna work on some sketches today i didn't actually talk about it yet but yeah we're gonna be sketching some emotes and another chibi work and i think that's probably gonna be it for today but yeah <clears throat> calico is like with splotches and tortoise are more mixed around i think yeah that's what i heard too but maybe it depends on the language to be fair did you know that calicos are all female or almost almost all female and when they are male it's like extremely rare and they're like hermaphrodite because like because of somehow like genetically speaking or g g like i forgot i think it's with the chromosome and stuff but like the thing that makes it that they have three colors in their fur is supposed to be only something with like female chromosome if that makes sense that's so weird but somehow that's how it is so if you like the rare cases of male calico cats are really rare and like some people can even try to like kidnap them and stuff because i guess because they're so rare they can be valuable so yeah you know so much about calico cats i don't know a lot i think i just probably because i have a calico i at some point check stuff about calicos and then i found out about that kidnap that's crazy right that's so sad <clears throat> God, welcome to the stream thank you for following but yeah i remember studying this genetic tendencies with calico cats in biology class Ooh, but yeah i mean a lot of cats that go outside are likely to get kidnapped in different phases if you're uh, if it's a kitten it can be kidnapped just because it's cute if it's like a valuable in quotation mark you know uh, a valuable breed it can be kidnapped as well and if it's like some gear stuff it can also be kidnapped yeah <laughs> unfortunately it's so cool it's carried on the xx chromosomes i think yeah that's what i heard i i, I don't remember the details like i remember reading about it but i don't for i don't remember the specifics but yeah <clears throat> but yeah it's 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 pretty crazy um yeah another thing that i found out about cats but it's not calico but just i talked about this on stream before but like if you have a white cat like a purely white cat without any like spot or anything that has blue eyes they're sometimes very very likely to be deaf and i think that's also something like in terms of genetics but like if they have i think the percentage of white cats with blue eyes that are deaf is like 80 percent so if you like ever like have a cat that fits those two uh categories or i guess criterias it's always good to check if your cat is deaf. I also know because uh, a few years ago we did have like a cat that was actually deaf and fitting those categories. <clears throat> I also have a cat, well two cats. One of the cats, his name is Bean and he's a Persian and have a male calico. His name is Dumpling. <clears throat> you know, I'm thinking of getting two females for them. Oh okay like okay <laughs> why though a male calico yeah that's that's pretty that's i think that's the first time i hear of someone having a male calico but yeah be careful it's dangerous dangerous outside but yeah i don't know the details though i remember actually okay i think the male calico thingy 
Luna hit them with the oh okay. No, it's just because like it feels like it's for breeding, so I don't know if it's for breeding, but if it's for breeding I'm like Yeah, it's not my thing, but it's not my place to comment on it. <clears throat> Imagine rolling male calico in your cat gets <laughs> Yeah. I don't I don't remember if they have like potential health issues because of it though. I don't remember. Why does it look like I'm bl I'm, I'm winking? I, I was blinking normally. I swear I'm not trying to just wink for no reason. <laughs> but yeah, my cats are valuable in emotional attachment. Like I don't know if someone would steal an X-ray fluffy tabby. Yeah, or I mean, at the end of the day, our cats are are like obviously the most like you know. We, we love them and they have like the biggest value in our hearts even if like some people wouldn't necessarily like want to steal them to like sell them or something at the end of the day they are our cats are like the, the prettiest cats or the best cats ever and and it's true for everyone just to, like probably how it is for children for the most part i think travel east thank you for following welcome <clears throat> My cat Gacha has mostly been abandoned cats. I mean, I think, I think it's good. Personally, I don't think I will ever try to get like a breed or something because there are so many. Like, I don't know. I don't really, really care about what the cat looks like. In my opinion, like, yeah, <laughs> I would prefer to like get it from. Uh, rescue shelters and that kind of stuff that's that's how it was for my cat and I think well I don't really plan on getting another cat so I don't know if I ever will have another cat but if I do I will probably just get it from like a shelter something I'll be potentially interested if I get to adopt another cat but you will need to have money for this is um sorry um getting a cat like an old cat because i think most people like to adopt pretty young cats or kittens and they're popular but old cats can easily get discarded and i feel like i would like cats to have like a good end of their lives if that makes sense and not just like stay in a shelter until they, they pass away so yeah, if if I ever get another cat someday, but I don't want to have like another cat as long as Mimi is alive, because I want to focus on Mimi. But yeah, maybe someday, if I can afford it, because I guess the downside of like old cats, outside of the fact that some people are less interested in old cats, but also it's more expensive because usually when a cat is older, they have health issues, so then they need to go to like the vet more and they need more treatments and stuff so yeah also ryan slee thank you for following the cats me and my parents got were abandoned close to where we live i think you told us about this i think i remember this but maybe i'm mixing things up that's so real or local that we move the adoption bit because we adopt one every time we can <laughs> my goodness <laughs> my goodness <clears throat> I wasn't there for the full stream last time, so how long do you usually interact with the comments until you start? Uh, do you mean like start drawing? Or like start the stream? Uh, I usually like, I, 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 I don't know. It's usually whenever I'm ready. And then if I see people are already writing in the chat, I try to type back if I'm not busy with other things stuff but it's not really something guaranteed yeah and then i chat for i guess as long as i want <laughs> but yeah usually it's not more than an hour though but it's usually less i think <sighs> and uh yeah <clears throat> start drawing yeah it, it's not a specific time but it's usually not more than an hour but I mean, I still, when I draw, I still try to read comments and reply to them. It's just that I'm also drawing, so I'm not as quick to react or I don't notice it as quickly because I'm also like, you know, <laughs> working. 
got to build up the courage to face all your past and show monsters. Oh my god. Yeah, every time I have to start a stream, I'm like, <sighs> here we go again. <laughs> no, everyone is fine. I was kind of excited to stream today because it's been a few it's been a few days. Here we go again. Yeah! Exactly! Perfectly written. Also, I really okay, this is something that I'm so glad that I always feel that way. When I'm away for a little bit and I'm not on the computer or not working on stream or not streaming in a while, like you know. It doesn't even have to be a full week, but like that happened to me this time, so like it can be uh, four or five days. When I open, when I turn on the computer again and I open VTube Studio and I see my model again and I see it move and I'm like, oh my god, I forgot how good it was. <laughs> like I, I keep like, I keep discovering, like I keep getting happy by the week. I think when I stream every day, I'm kind of used to it because I see it all the time. But when I'm back after a little like a little break or a few days of not checking, then I'm like, wow, it's so nice, it's so smooth, I'm so happy. <clears throat> <clears throat> this is not something someone paid you to do. Can I draw with you? I mean, this is like most of what I do. Also, I think it's written in the description of the YouTube stream, but this is gonna be commission work as well today, so paid work. But I mean, that doesn't have to uh, prevent you from drawing whatever you want at the same time. We can be productive together. <clears throat> you don't have to draw exactly the same thing that I do. Uh, also, to be honest, today I'm just gonna do sketches, so it's not gonna be like some finished drawings. <clears throat> The other cats were abandoned close to where my little brother's ex-girlfriend lived or ba babies of those cats Oh my god, how many- okay Who in the chat has cats and how many do you have? I know, I know some people already answered the question before by telling me about their cats But for those that haven't I'm curious about how many- Not- y you know what? Not even cats Just pets in general If you have any pet, I want to know How many do you have? Or what kind of pets are those? Let's let's talk about pets. I have two cats, I might adopt two more. Yeah, I remember that. Pets in general, then then two. <laughs> it's okay. Uh, maybe someday if this is something you want in your future. I did have one some time ago. Oh, what? A cat? But yeah. Mm, I'm trying to think. Honestly, I realized that I've been mostly surrounded with pets growing up, like my mother had a dog that was there before I was born for quite a while and then I remember we had fishes when we were really young but well, it's usually not really good for them so we don't have this anymore but, but back when we were like really young we did have a few fishes and then Mimi and another dog and now it's like yet a different dog <sighs> and also one time we had to like kind of take care of kittens I guess fishes yay I remember like it's it's so far away you know in the past because it was when we were really young and you know I'm, I'm like 80 86 but God, I remember some some vague memories that were kind of wild. I have to go now, but I'll be lurking for the rest of the stream. I hope you'll have a nice day and take care of ev no, take care everyone. <laughs> Click on the sketches and have fun. Thank you. Also, thank you for the hydration regime. If you come with pet rocks and random bugs and snails, I find them a lot. Let's go. My family used to have a German Shepherd double and also an orange and a grey cat, but I only knew the dog and the grey cat. Oh. Thank you for the hydration. My cousin has 16 cats. Oh my goodness. I hope they have a good environment for all of them. I feel like that's probably why I wouldn't want to have too many cats because I feel like you need to have an adopted, uh, you know, like you have to get a proper environment for the animals. But I heard that having like 
too many cats in a small place is usually not good for them, so... Ouch! <coughs> Thank you, I'm like 80, 86 blinks one eye at a time. Now, I was thinking, okay? <clears throat> but yeah, I remember for the cats that- uh, not the, 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 the fishes. I remember. This was so wild. Like, most of those things I don't remember. But like, usually it was like, cause I have like, I lived with my uh, sister also. And like, we used to have one fish each. And I know that there was one time where like, my sister's fish like, jumped out of the buckle and like well died and it was so sad like my sister was devastated and i think we got another fish and i remember another thing that marked me a lot and now that i think back i'm like oh my god why did we do this because it's so bad <laughs> but i will i will tell the story anyway okay so there was one time where we both had like a fish and we had to go on vacation so we asked the neighbor if they could like you know regularly come over to feed the the fishes and stuff or take care of the fishes and they were like okay and then <laughs> my god and then during our vacation i'm guessing that somehow the neighbor might have forgotten to like take care of the fishes at some point because one of them died and it's not the fact that one of them died that makes me think of this but it's rather the fact that they replaced the dead fish by another one and it was like my sister's fish that like died so the dead f like the my sister's fish got replaced by a new one but i think the neighbor didn't really like do their research and so the fish that they got for my sister was like a very like aggressive fish a fish that like does not live well with other fishes so shortly after we return the replaced fish killed my fish <laughs> like that was so crazy like uh, like what the what the hell and then yeah it was like i i, I vaguely remember it it was so wild and and i think I don't know why we, we we did this. What what's this trauma inducing fish story? It was so bad. Villain origin story. And then I know and I'm thinking about it, I'm like, oh my god, why did we do this? I was very young so I didn't really realize, but now I'm like, oh, why did we do this? What we did after was releasing the aggressive fish in like like outside like i think there was a park with like it's not a river but it was like water and i think we let it go there but i don't think this was a good thing to do at all for like the ecosystem and stuff and now i'm like oh, why did we do this also like why didn't we just like i don't know return the fish instead of like getting rid of it like putting it in the wild like that oh my god i shall i shall ask my parents if they remember this because maybe i'm like misremembering or maybe they have a better explanation but no i'm like Oh my god, why did we do this? That's so bad! Ecosystem is number one. Luna Hater. To be fair, I'm not the one who did it. It's like my, my, my parents did, okay? But that was that was so wild. Like I think this is my biggest memory of my like fishes and stuff. Put the aggressive fish in <laughs> I mean it's not even the fish's fault. It's just that the the neighbor didn't do their research when they tried to get a, a second fish and like i'm pretty sure that if you check you can know easily that because i think it's like specific to just the kind of fish it is that it's just a fish that fights and that does not live with like other fishes or or maybe either other fishes of a different species or like just other fishes in general like i don't think this was like just something that that we had no way of knowing but yeah fish from the street <laughs> i don't know i don't know how it went i also don't even remember how we got fishes like did we buy them from a pet store because uh, pet stores are usually not the best places to buy pets in general so i, I don't remember i should ask my my family <sighs> 
No wonder Luna has to move a lot. She keeps ruining ecosystem wherever she goes. So true. Like, it's me running away from the consequences of my actions. <laughs> but yeah, this is such a wild story. And I remember, like, one of my... Okay. Um, there's, like, one fish that I had when I was younger than that. Because actually, I think that this experience was, like... The, f the last uh, fishes that we got, I think after that we didn't have fishes anymore. But when I was younger, there was like... Because usually we just got like... Very common fishes, like goldfishes, I guess. Like, they kind of all look the same. But I remember there was one fish that I got, and I remember it was like... Black. And I thought it looked so cool and so pretty, and I love this fish so much. And I don't know why... Well, I, I used to, when I was younger, I was quite into the Teletubbies. <laughs> and, I, like, my favorite was Po, but I did like Tinky Winky quite a lot too. So, I named my fish after this Teletubby. But, by then, because the names, like, Tinky Winky is the same in the Forbidden Language. But, you don't really have an explanation for this name. Like, it doesn't really, like, it's not like it's translated or anything. And so I think back then, I called it something else because I oh I used to believe that it was pronounced that way. So it's basically me butchering someone's name, and that's how my fish got named. Moral of the story: I won't get fishes anymore. But if I did, I could name it after the chat probably. <laughs> God, what's the fish equivalent of the streets? Fish from the streams? Fish from the current? You can just say fish from the wild. Probably. No, wait. Fish from like the waterfalls. Doesn't it feel even more extreme? It's like the fish saw like everything. <clears throat> but yeah. Outside of that, I think, yeah. I, I feel like we stopped having fishes pretty early though. Like, I, I'm pretty. I feel like my. Age was probably still in the single digits at the time. Waterfall tube. <laughs> I'm sorry. Sorry for, for recommending things, for suggesting stuff. <clears throat> after your fish experiences, please do not name a fishy after me. <laughs> but I'm not butchering your name. I just call you Mittal. Like, that should be the case for, like, I don't know, Dante. But yeah, I mean, that would be weird still to have like some pet named after some, some viewers, not gonna lie. I just thought it would be funny. How about get a fish named Metal? Ha let's just make a robot fish and name it that. No. What do you mean now? You should be flattered. Never, never satisfied, never happy, always, always complaining. Some H my head. Um, here. All right. Okay. So, just talking again about what we're gonna do today. SMH my SMH. <laughs> and then it's like just a stream where I just say it all the time until I finally reach the head. Too long. SMH my. My fish? Where's the H? <laughs> fish SMH my- What the hell? <laughs> I'm so confused. <laughs> Bruh. This makes no sense. <sighs> A stream? Fish reference? Oh my god. Fish my fish. That actually makes sense. That reminds me, in Fish My Fish, reminds me of one thing that is like it's it's not really a meme, but I saw it going around on social media about 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 something in the Forbidden Language, because uh, there are some words that sound exactly the same but are written differently. And so there is like one sentence that's literally the same sound over and over again that means something and it's like your ankle mouths your fish 
and it's like tum, 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 tum. but this is actually a thing like this is a real thing fishing my fish made me think of that mowing your tuna whatever that means how do you know my ankle uh that's personal sorry <laughs> I've seen that. I think there are some others, but this one is the most. Uh, the one I remember. Ankle. No. A ankle. <clears throat> You're gonna tune into the next stream to find out. Oh my god. You didn't do that one. I can't believe it. You're saying. I I'm saying ankle! Okay, what's. How do you pronounce it now? I'm getting. I'm getting confused. How is it? And what am I doing wrong? Ankle is like ankle, ankle, ankle. I don't say ankle. I say ankle, ankle. Right, it's the same thing. Literally, wait. Is it? <gasps> wait, on the on the Google Translate, it says it's the same pronunciation. That's why you're saying the same thing. I hear the difference. It's not my fault if you if you don't. <laughs> I thought you said ankle, and that's why I was confused. No, like, the, you know, like, the bro of your your dad or your mom or whatever. I'm so tired of this. I regret the stream already. <laughs> Just say ankle. No one says that. Whatever. <clears throat> but yeah. Um, so, talking about the plan for the stream for real because I keep getting distracted with like people making fun of my, my pronunciations. No comment. <laughs> but, um, what am I doing? What am I doing? Yes, so the plan for today is to uh, work on different sketches. The sketches are gonna be for Vampy, who I worked for before. Uh, we're gonna sketch mostly emotes. Uh, but it's gonna be not really in the usual batch because, uh, I mean, some of them will be, but some of them will not because it's for layered emotes. I forgot to change this here. And there's also a chibi additionally to the regular thingy that will be separate. Uh, like just a, a separate drawing that's not like for emotes. So this is mostly what we're gonna do. I feel like this will be pretty quick to make probably. And I don't really have plans for the rest of the stream. So we'll see after that what we do. And and yeah. <clears throat> Doing that when Twitch is not Twitch bullies her for a pronunciation for the thirty thousandth time. Was it thirty thousand? Yeah. Thank you for the heads up. You made her angrily and the chatting part. <laughs> yeah, I'm leaving. I mean, to be fair, it's been a while now. Like, it's been a, it's been like 15 minutes. So I think with the stretches, it's a good place to end the chatting portion. For the well, it's not like we don't chat anymore. It's just that I chat and draw. <laughs> but yeah, I'm sorry for making fun of you. Take a head pat. Well, thanks for apologizing, I guess. Yeah. I forgot we stretch. Yeah! I mean, usually we don't really stretch for like... Wow, okay. Wait, what did I... Wait, what did I say? I forgot. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> what did I do? Why are you offended? Did I say something that I already forgot? Probably. Hmm. <clears throat> Also, I saw the names. Don't worry. I saw the cat names. It's just that... Yeah. But I saw it. <clears throat> I just don't read every comment every time. That's funny because I forgot to. Oh my god. <laughs> this... <laughs> just... Just... Who has a brain cell in this stream? I wonder. Clearly not me, but clearly not you either. Probably whoever worked on the assets for the stream. <clears throat> but yeah. Wow. Yeah. Actual goldfish memory. It's true. Like, it's so embarrassing. <laughs> it's so embarrassing. 
It's even worse when it's like in the middle of saying something and then suddenly I forget what I'm trying to say and I'm just pain. But that's how it is. That's my life. Memory of a toothpick. Okay, that's the first time I hear that one. Fish mentioned. Oh my god. That's the worst. Well, I'm used to it. I just I just feel embarrassed when I meet people. Like recently I met someone and I try to tell them stuff and I regularly forget what I'm saying in the middle of the sentence. And it's someone I appreciate, but it's also not someone I'm super close to. So this felt kind of embarrassing, not gonna lie. I was like, my God, this person must think I'm like the dumbest person ever. And like, they were just like, just, just like, yeah, it's fine. But I don't know, I was embarrassed. I just wanted to be cool and I was not. But that's, that's, I guess, just my usual day. <clears throat> All right. Where can I find the stream schedule? Um, I usually upload it on the community page of the YouTube channel. So it's like, I think on the channel, how does it work on YouTube? It's like, if you click on the channel link, then there are like tabs and there's one tab that's a like community and usually there are posts that are sharing the schedule. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm not gonna lie, Vully took me a solid miniature. Yeah, I'm not reading that either. I, I don't want to. I. Vully, English only. So true, Vully. Read the rules. <laughs> Can't believe. <clears throat> but yeah, okay. Um, we're gonna stretch, and after that, we can draw. Uh, I have to admit, I didn't really prepare the stream super well today. Uh, in the way that I think I prepared the video, but I didn't prepare the overlay to like have the, 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 the stretches. So I need to do that. I'm sorry. I didn't like do stuff very like, okay. Oh my God. It's just empty. Hi everyone. Here. Yay. All righty. I just need to get smaller because I'm kind of big right now. Yippee! Okay. This is it. Wait, why am I like this actually? I shouldn't- No, wait. All oh, right, I moved the stream back then because you know I had like a smaller Luna with the gun. So I'm supposed to be here. Yeah, okay. This should be fine. Hopefully. Whew, so complicated. Yeet! Um... Yeah. <clears throat> Luna wanting to impress someone. Fail. Just, 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 yeah. You know, how do you know that's not English? It may be English word, but you, you just all don't know it because you're foolish. So true. Uh, but then I will say keep the chat relevant. Because if we don't know it, then it's something we don't know. Wait, did I just say if we don't know it, then it's something we don't know? Wow, thanks. Thanks, Hilly, for those words of wisdom. When you lose your train of thoughts and then you gotta think, what were you thinking? Because b before that, and then try to remember, yeah, and then I fail. It's my life. Whatever, I will stop trying to say anything at this point. <laughs> if you want to live, survive. I mean, that one at least could be like, you know, like... You know, you want to live, at least do the effort of trying to survive. In my case, I literally just repeated the thing. It's like, when you live, you live. You're welcome. <laughs> Actually, living and surviving are different things. So true, Serenity, you tell them. You tell them. But yeah, well, whatever. Um... <clears throat> Can you say no? I will just stretch. All right, explaining the stretch section for the people in the chat, or the people in the lurk, or the people in in uh whatever. Um, rest in peace, Bully Blue. Um, so if you're new here or new to this part of the stream, welcome to the stretch section. Ba -ba -da -ba -ba -ba. So basically, before we draw, we're gonna do some hand exercises to make sure that we don't have pain after we avoid injuries on the long term or we avoid 
um, sore muscles and to do that we're just taking the healthy habit of stretching before the art section <sighs> and we're gonna watch the youtube video available called stretch routine for artists and animators that is credited on the youtube description and the twitch panel for like credits and if you want to access it easily, there is a, 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 a comment in the chat that is exclamation mark stretch. Whenever you type it in the chat, you will get the thing. I forgot what I was saying. You will get the link. Oh my god. Seeing the, the nonsense in, in the chat right now. Makes me so confused. <laughs> um, but yeah. So we're gonna do those exercises. If you decide to stretch along, well, I do encourage it to everyone, regardless of whether people draw or not. I think it's something we can all benefit from. But if you decide to stretch along, just keep in mind that the stretches are not supposed to be painful or extreme. Uh, it's just supposed to be helpful for the day but you're not supposed to be in pain when doing the exercises. So if some of the um, things shown in the screen uh, hurt when you do it, please don't push to that pain. Maybe stretch a bit less extremely or le less in intensely, intensively. I don't know what the word is anymore, but yeah. <laughs> Make sure that you're wise when you stretch. If it hurts, uh, feel free to stop or to chill a bit yeah goodness i actually have no idea uh oh my god wait eh? wait 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 oh my god okay i was i was intensely thank you please don't feel bad there are people calling luna i'm not reading that but yes that's worse <laughs> all right i got i got so confused reading the chat like what is happening but no i understand people extreme stretching no that's not what we do that's not what we do we are chilling with the stretches okay we are just it's supposed to help the words you say are difficult to understand i'm sorry <laughs> I guess I guess my my streams are for the big brains only. That's how it works. Clearly, it's not that I can't it's not that I can't pronounce things and that what I say doesn't make sense. Is it's that only the smartest of the people can understand my wisdom. Clearly, it's actually what's happening. If you don't understand, uh, it's because your IQ hasn't reached uh, four digits yet. Sorry. <clears throat> Chili, it's spicy. Aggression is spicy. What's aggressive? Luna's old fish. So that was... White wool? Wit woolly? How do you say that? Oh my god. The fish reference. I, I hate this. Anyway, let's just stretch, okay? Let's let's be cool and stretch. <laughs> god, okay. <clears throat> Lucy, hello, Provacus. Welcome. Okay, I'm gonna start the video now because otherwise we're just never gonna <laughs> stretch and never draw. Miss you, how was your weekend? Uh, um, um, oh, literally, oh my god. Sorry, I'm, I'm, my brain is not smart enough for this apparently. But yeah, I had a nice weekend. I hope everyone had a nice weekend as well. Okay, I'm really starting the video this time because. It's, it's taking too long all right i hope everyone decides to stretch along we'll have a nice stretch and for the comments that i will miss i'll try to read them after the stretches wait don't start no i will i'm so i'm not ready i'm tired of waiting it's been an hour whatever i'm leaving welcome to the basic stretch routine for artists and animators we're going to start with our wrists and hands so take your arms shut up straight out <laughs> point your palms straight up and pull back <laughs> <laughs> Hold that for about 10 seconds. <laughs> Relax and form your hands into fists and hold them straight out. Keep holding. Hold that pose for a couple seconds. And 
turn your wrists down to the floor and back in up towards your arm until you feel a stretch. Hold that and release. Tuck your thumbs into your palms and fold your fingers over them and turn these fists down towards the floor until you feel a stretch. And relax. Hold one of your arms out, turn your palm in to face you, turn your fingers in, and pull that hand towards your body. And release. And do the same with the other hand. Palm faces you, fingers in, pull that hand towards your body. And relax. Next, we'll do the stretch that requires the flat surface. Place your palm upside down on the wall and press towards the wall. Go as far as you can and hold that pose. Reach around with the other hand and pull your thumb up. Now we'll do the same with the other arm. Palm down. Pull up on your thumb. Relax. Now we'll do fingers. Start with your first hand. Pull your index finger up. Try to wiggle those other fingers a little bit. Relax and shake it out. Next finger, pull up towards your body. Don't pull so hard that you feel any pain, just enough to get a stretch. Wiggle your fingers a little bit if you can. Relax and shake it out. Next finger, stretch that finger out. And relax. Next we'll do the pinky. Pull that pinky towards you. Wiggle your fingers a little bit and relax. Now we're going to do the opposite direction with the fingers. Pull your index finger in towards your palm and hold it there. Do the next finger. We're holding each pose for about 10 seconds. Wiggle the fingers and shake that hand out. Next finger. Relax. And we'll move on to the pinky. the thumb, pull your thumb back, and wave your fingers a little bit, relax. Now we're going to push the thumb in, stretch it out in the other direction. Wiggle your fingers, and good. Last, just stretch out in between your fingers. Use your other hand to stretch your fingers out. Go in between each pair. Don't need to hold it, just push them apart. Now we're going to move on to the other hand. Always want to stretch both sides for balance. Good. We'll do the next finger, pull it back. Same routine as before. fingers, shake it out, move on to the pinky, wiggle your fingers, 
fingers and relax. Now same thing, just in the opposite direction. Pull your finger in towards the palm of your hand. Hold it there for about 10 seconds. Into the middle finger. Next finger, pull it in towards your palm. And the pinky. And once again, we'll do the thumb, pull your thumb back. Push your thumb in to stretch it out in the other direction. Hold it there. Wiggle your fingers. And good. Now just stretch out in between the fingers, the other hand. And relax. And to finish the stretch routine, just take your fingers and spread them apart as far as they'll go. Hold that for a few seconds. Good, shake it out, and one more time. Spread your fingers apart slowly as far as they'll go and hold it there. And release, shake it out. And that's a stretch routine. <sighs> okay, so I didn't prepare the art program for this. Uh, let me open it, here we go. And I need to get. Uh, God, I realize there are some things I need to delete. Let me delete one thing. Here, you're gonna hear a, a window sound. I apologize in advance. Oh, never mind. No, no window sound. Cool. <laughs> that's that's nice. <laughs> All right. <clears throat> so. Um, let me change the category to art before I forget. Uh, here and here. So, hi, Scronin! How are you today? Set game art. Alright. Also, I just realized I didn't do the mediums. No, I think I did, actually. I think I did. I don't believe it, but I think I did. Okay, I did now. Three. Um... Let me see. Yeah, okay. Okay, okay, okay. Um what the Alright. Here we go. I want to I can see a thing. Yeah, I didn't open a canvas yet, so this is just my program, but there is no there is no drawing right now because I mean I will start from a blank canvas anyway. Talking for a bit again or straight to art? Uh, now we're doing the art part, but I will be still reading the chat and reacting and stuff. I do need to open, like, find the right canvas though. And I'm gonna, like, first open it on something you won't see just because I want to make sure that I don't show something I'm not supposed to. <clears> hmm. <throat> Stop. Stop it. Stop it! What do you mean? Don't talk to me. <laughs> okay, wait. Let me let me try to find the thing uh, I drew for a vampire this year. What did I do? Whatever. Um. Okay, so I just realized that the batch, like the, the template, is almost full with emotes for a vampire anyway. <clears throat> no need to spam in chat, by the way. I already said hi to you before. Uh, so I'm gonna make a new, like, basically open a new uh, template. 
And from this also I need to like delete the stuff that I did in the wrong layer. Here, here. Okay, here. Okay, and I'm gonna basically copy paste some emails that I did before. And from that I will Oh where put it. Um so I will just try to find like I don't know five emotes maybe that I did for the person. Uh, this is kind of scuffed. Uh, so five. Honestly, this will work. This here, here, here. That's four, and then here five. All right, I'm gonna use those four as a reference. Just so I can basically access like the palette and everything quickly. And I know this pad that I drew the emotes in. Okay, here, and then those two. There we go. Now just place them properly so it's not like frustrating to look at. <clears throat> On a scale of moderate to intensely, how annoying would you say Twitch chat is being right now? I wouldn't say it intensely. <laughs> it's fine. It's fine. Um. Alright. I will also just need to access some uh messages with Vampy just to make sure i have the reference and everything so basically for now i'm gonna draw i think one emote one emote will be normal that's gonna be like here and then there will be two emotes that will have like two versions because they're like two frames like it's not a smooth animation but it's like something simple with like an alternative version so those two will probably be here and there. And then after this, I'll be sketching two more emotes, but in a separate canvas because it's layered and then it needs to be its own thing. And after that, I will draw a chibi. <clears throat> get commissioned by the people with the prettiest OCs. I know, right? I'm so happy I get to work on emotes for, for, for Vampy because I really, 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 really like this design a lot i'm very like i love working with that kind of palette and i'm just i'm so lucky <clears throat> all right um so uh let me just open my dms so i see whatever i need to look at i have ten thousand windows open on the side this is a disaster <laughs> oh thank you for the welcome comment i will I will uh, pin this. Oh my god, wait. Ugh. Here. Alright, and then I will pin this on YouTube as well. Here we go. Here we go. Wait. Oh my god, I'm on the wrong channel. <laughs> wait, how come? I thought I was in the right channel, but I guess I'm not. Okay, wait. I need to... I need to access the, the YouTube chat with the streaming channel otherwise i can't pin it okay so this i get it right here and then why why can't that oh my god okay wait. this is this is this is complicated but i can make it work eventually this will work why is this not working sorry i'm trying to make my 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 comment into a pinned one but ah uh, there we go all right okay 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 so uh yeah we good all right i'm gonna try this and i still need to open my messages sorry this is kind of like taking forever I have also no idea what kind of playlist I'm gonna be playing uh, today. 
I, I don't really have much ideas this time sometimes i have like i feel like listening to specific things but today i don't really have a specific uh mood in mind i like here <sighs> but i should wait i have to do this i have done i'm just gonna like close all the things i have open and this will be here and just save little things this will go here this i need to close okay sorry this is this is a bit poorly organized today not gonna lie i could have i could have prepared this a bit better so uh wait here and then the reference is okay i have like different reference i have like did I download the references before? I think I have. But for some reason, I can't have the proper preview. Okay, now I see it. Okay. Pretty good. Sorry for the inconvenience. Okay, we can actually draw now. Now, wait. First, I need to get the... <laughs> first, I need to get a different playlist. Mm. I kind of... Okay, you know what? Because usually the... Like, usually the design was kind of like Arctic Fox. I kind of want to listen to winter music. So let's see if we find like winter game music. Winter game music. Preferably like Nintendo. Oh, wait, this looks cool. Wait, but does this work? No, wait. I'll, s I'll write Nintendo because I want to make sure that it works. But at the same time, wait, I found a play that might be cool. I will try something. I don't know how it's gonna sound. We, we will experiment. I also don't know if the VOD will be saved, but I want to try. Okay. A computer. Um, okay, here. And then let's try listening to this. Wait. Oof. How does it start you? Uh, let me know if the volume needs to be adjusted, if it's too loud, if it's not loud enough. Let me know. Okay. Oh my god. Winter music is so good. So. The first thing is actually not even Vampy herself, but her mascot, I think. I think. If I recall correctly, this volume should be good. Okay, thank you. Thank you for telling me. Um. Okay. Yeah, the first thing. Yeah, it's a nodding mask. And the reference is like this. So it's a sitting mascot kind of oh my god sorry for the window sound this time a sitting mascot that will be like moved around to nod but i'm not really like i was commissioned for a single thing so uh what does does it look like again i should actually copy paste this so i have two references here and there okay oh that's not what i wanted to do okay i'm trying to figure out how i can like make the uh, the mascot work <laughs> Here Sophie, thank you. I, I, I honestly, I'm not super confident yet, so I hope I can do it well, because it's, 
It's it's not really what I'm used to. <laughs> okay, here. All right. Oh my. It's so hot here today, send help. How warm is it here? 
or just there. It's pretty, like, I wouldn't say it's cold here, but it's just, it's not hot either. It's like comfortable. Comfortable? I mean, actually, it's... I don't think it's that comfortable anymore because it's kind of... Oh my god, what happened? It looks like the weather is getting kind of bad here. It's 32 degrees. Oh god, my condolences. I think I saw that it will, it will, it will be kind of warm soon. So maybe I will die later. That little flower is so cute. Thank you. I I I I'm kind of like struggling, but <laughs> thank you. It's 40. Oh my god, that's really warm. Make sure you stay hydrated and stay in the shade. Because I only have like one view of the mascot, I don't really know if this is how it will sit normally. So I guess I'll have to like show this and see if it's supposed to be different after. But this is a very cute mascot. I I it's I I, I don't know if this mascot has been already like put on the channel of the streamer yet or not, but but. I hope whoever watches these streams, Vampy streams, will enjoy what it looks like. It's very cute. Can I get some shade too? Is it warm here too? Is everyone dying today? <laughs> everyone is struggling. Okay, so we have this. I'll put this a bit higher. Maybe I'll... Yeah it a bit further okay ah oh, this song we know this song send me some ice cube please it's cold actually why do you want some shade this is why Andrew Luna stream she keeps throwing shade at the chat oh my god <laughs> I didn't even say anything this time Man. <sighs> and then, okay, I see the other two that I need to do. Um. Okay. Was it worth a shot? How dare you! So, actually, this one barely has an alternative version. It's like it's like the Carter is crying, but like the two versions are just gonna be like different kinds of eye glow. So it looks like the eye glow is like you know moving, like she's about to cry or something. Actually, she has a few tears, but yeah, it's gonna be pretty simple. No, 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 no. Maybe I will change the direction so it looks like she's facing up. Like she's looking up and not like down. I'm putting the iris up there. Luxish! Hello! Happy 20 month! My god. I never, I swear, I never realized how long people subscribe for, so I'm always like, wow, that's so long. <laughs> god. Thank you! How are you? Oh my god, I'm yawning now. <laughs> okay. Thank you 
thank you. supposed to pronounce it differently <laughs> feel free to let me know but thank you for following welcome to the stream <clears> hoi <throat> hilly hi how are you today luxish thank you for well subscribing again tired and on my way to bed but i had to drop in on the lovely hilly comfy streams oh is the volume okay i feel like it's getting kind of loud I also don't like how I drew the eyes, so I think I'm just gonna restart this emote from scratch. Alcatraz. Alcatraz? Alcatraz? It's Alca, right? Or Alsa? Oh my god, I don't know. But I'll try to remember that. Alcatraz. Thank you for letting me know. I appreciate when people let me know that I am butchering their names unwillingly. Because then I have a chance of fixing my ways, which is nice. Hmm. Okay. I ended up with some of these emotes of the Wu you're drawing. You did very well with them as always. Ah, oh, I hope you're enjoying uh, enjoying them. I'm guessing that you like the one that you are using the most. Wait, actually I need to zoom it in because I don't even fully know if the car is supposed to smile or not. It's kind of unknown. I think it might be smiling. Might be like, like, like this, you know. But it's a close up, so I need to make it like really, really, really close. Cute chibis, thank you, Hugo. How are you today? Oh my god, I feel like I haven't drawn in ages. I'm getting rusty and I just it's it's not like I haven't drawn in like a really long time but that's how it feels like Doing well. Hope you're doing well too. Yes, I am. Thank you. Also thank you for the hydration reading. Usually I have tea but because it's the afternoon and usually my tea is in the morning, I just have water. This is less motivating, not gonna lie. <laughs> I feel like a youngster that doesn't want to like drink water. Only sweet drinks. But water is important too. No, T with a T, like the letter. Like a cup of tea. Not tea. Tea. <laughs> I don't know if you can even hear the difference. Cup, not 
Ashi, the drink, the beverage where you 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 put some like uh, leaves and then you infuse it. Come on, come on. <laughs> I'm getting rusty while cooking. Ten star drawings. No, I'm having a hard time making it look like what I want. Pain. And then it's gonna like switch between this and the other, the other kind of sparkles. Um, I need to check the reference of the card here, but maybe I'll do that after actually. Actually, maybe I should draw the the other emo to do the one with the clap. I don't know this version though. I'm just saying that is this a is this fan version? Oh yeah, it's a cover. I love this song so much. It's such a beautiful Pokemon song. But I was thinking that I didn't know this arrangement. It's very nice. <laughs> so good Pokemon. Pokemon has so many good tracks but this cover is really good like I really like this arrangement but I don't like how I drew this <laughs> I'm struggling today well on the bright side all I have to do today is sketches so I was afraid that I will uh, like finish my work too early but seeing that i'm struggling that means that it's 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 a longer time streaming <laughs> so that's cool <laughs> lindsay struggling that's me hi
If you're not struggling, something's not right. I'm not always struggling. Today I am though. <laughs> but I think it's normal because I haven't drawn in a few days. And I haven't really done anything work related in a few days. So I think, yeah, but it's fine. That doesn't mean that I will not do something that will come out well. Okay, I like this face. I think it's cute. Uh, the other one... I have to think about it. Okay. So, I need to draw the features of the character now. Which will be fine. Um, let me just read something. Because I think there are like information. Luna hasn't yawned since I joined guys, I'm scared. It's because now I'm very awake. <laughs> Actually, when you mentioned just yawning, uh, it does make me want to yawn a bit. So now I'm, I kind of want to, but I'm trying to resist this urge. <laughs> what have you done? No, I feel like I have to not yawn. Like it's, it's my pride. Stop, stop doing this. Stop writing this in the chat <laughs> stop this <clears throat> can you feel the yawn in the back of your throat i wouldn't even say the back it's like somehow i will feel more the yawn not at the back of my throat but i like the corners of my cheeks if that makes sense like like here it's almost like there's air that's like yawn and then, yeah, <laughs> I know that doesn't really make sense, but that's how, that's how it feels to me. Don't you want to believe it? Now! We'll be in the, in jail forever. Okay, so for this, we have the features, so that's cool. I just do this, yeah, okay, perfect. And then I need to do the same for the other one.
But maybe this is a bit too thick here. Because I still want the nose to be visible. There we go. I can feel the young coming. No! You know what? Actually, because you're kind of like pissing me off like this. Okay, you're not actually pissing me off. But because you, you, you're, you're doing this, I have strong reactions against it so now this is actually making me even more weak and now i'm even less likely to yawn therefore by doing this you're trying to make me yawn but you're in fact failing because i'm getting more energetic boom it's your loss mm -hmm. jokes on you keep your yawn okay Welcome, Ellie Crowin. Crowin? Crowin? Welcome. <laughs> I guess maybe yawn too much time already. Damn, already? Impressive. Destroyed my defeat. <laughs> and then watch me yawn right after. <laughs> that will be so, so tragic, actually so unfortunate for my my pride and my credibility pain also thank you for following um trying to understand how to draw this because you know how okay this is not really the case in the emails that i drew here but vampy a lot of the time has like some like she has a hoodie and I drew some emotes with the hood on, but I forgot to actually do this. I forgot to um, to open or show like the versions with it. But yeah, got any tips for being a freelance artist? Communicate. Communicate when you have clients, like. I feel like if you behave really well and are really professional and communicative and you know you behave like like you know if you're really pleasant to work with people are more likely to come back more for the quality of the service in the way that you know you're transparent you update people and stuff which maybe like maybe it's supposed to be obvious but apparently it's not because the amount of like people that don't do that is baffling but yeah if you communicate people are more like feel like okay i, I, I i'm saying so much to not even finish a sentence but basically to me the quality of your communication and service and you know transparency and everything is more valuable than the skill that you provide obviously you still have to like not butcher the drawing but if you are very pleasant to work with i think people are more likely to come back even if uh you know you're not the best artist ever compared to if your art is really great, but you're like ghosting the client for like half of a year. This is not good. <laughs> so yeah, to me, what's the most important is the communication and being professional and respectful of, you know, the client's money, the client's time, etc. But of course, that doesn't mean that, you know, like you also need to set some terms of service to protect yourself as well because there are always also some clients that are not very respectful and can potentially like just not be respectful of your time so yeah but to me being communicative is the most important part it's not even just about deadlines and stuff but just also if they request something that you might not have experience in I think even if you want to do it it's always wise to say that you can't like you you're not as used to do it but that you're willing to do it because then the client will appreciate that you're not trying to like you know like that you're you're, you're honest with this and then they might you know give you something else still even if they don't go for this in the end but in my opinion being transparent is the most important thing <clears throat> Also, hi Andy Goal! Good evening to you! Thank you for the 22 months, my god. 
I'm sorry. I hope you're doing well. Hello, hello. Sorry, I didn't react right away because I was so into my my, my talk about like my tip for freelance artist. But yeah. Also, thank you, Roxy. Thank you for passing by. I love being transparent, she vanished. Let me my let me make myself clear, she vanished. God, see, no one is taking me seriously when I'm giving proper advice. I can't believe it. <clears throat> Does the price differ with the skill, or is there like a starting price for every new artist? Uh, did you do a fake stream earlier? I tried to join, but your stream didn't seem to be running. Oh, really? I mean, there is a time where I think the stream kind of like struggled, but I think it didn't even crash, so I don't know. Like I, I, my stream was in, like started at, uh, it started like around two hours ago. So if you tried to join earlier, I just wasn't streaming. <clears throat> and for the question about the price, uh, personally, I guess it depends on also what you offer, but I think it's important to not charge yourself less than $10. Dollars, unless you really do this in like one minute maybe, but even then like give yourself at least at least 10 10 dollars i feel like this could be 10 dollars for your smallest thing assuming that it's not a doodle that takes like you know one minute maybe but even then it's valid if you want to charge 10 dollars for it i think but i'm, I'm trying to think on the perspective like on on the idea of someone that wants to start out and might not have like as much visibility or commission commission commissions yeah yeah i think ten dollars should be at least the base because it's you know like usually around minimum weight right like 10 hours per hour so try to give ten dollars unless again you feel like it's really short uh it's really quick compared to what you do now it's really quick compared to the price you make but that's what I will be comment still. And then the more advanced the uh, offer is, depending on, you know, like if you think an icon is the quickest thing you do or the easiest thing to do, you can do like, I don't know, 10. You could probably do more, but you, you can do 10. And then for services that require more work and more time, you gradually increase it. That's what I will do. 10 hours per hour. 10 dollars, sorry. I can't speak. <laughs> <clears throat> It was about 10 minutes after your go live tweet when I tried to- Oh, I think, yeah, I think uh, that's when my uh, connection got kind of weird, so maybe that's why? Because, yeah, I had, for like around a minute during the this this time, I did have like a connection issue. So maybe, maybe that's why. <clears throat> This has actually been some interesting info. Thank you for sharing. That's what I will say, but obviously I'm kind of privileged. Well, I wouldn't say privileged, but I didn't start out commissions thinking that this will be my livelihood or anything. I've been doing commissions for a while, but at first it was just like kind of, a, you know, just, oh, it could be nice to do commissions. And then I did commission. <laughs> But uh, when I started out, I, I, I don't remember how much I charged, but I don't think I necessarily had the same rules. And I know that for people that start out, it's not necessarily as easy. Welcome, S S S S Natasha. I guess I'll say Natasha. Welcome, Natasha. Thanks for the tip again. I wanted to start commissions as a side income, but I don't really know what or where to start. I do have plans to get into the professional side later on. Ooh. Uh, well, hmm. Um, um trying to think if i can give more advice yeah i guess it depends on it it depends on several things but to me this will be a good starting point if if your commissions take you know like many hours though please give yourself more like like higher prices like if you can also just do like yeah thinking about your commission and like how long they take usually and then you do like 10 multiplied by the amount of hours it takes but usually the risk is that with new commissions sometimes people are not finding your commissions as much so maybe 
it's difficult to find commissions and usually people that start with cheaper prices are more likely to get commissions because a lot of people are more willing to pay for cheaper prices i guess but also um of course i think if at some point you get a lot of commissions to the point that you know like this is getting a bit too much this might be worth uh starting to increase your prices because then you will lose commissioners technically you will have people that will not come back for the kind of more expensive prices but usually there will be people that will still be willing to pay that and so you will unless you really increase it drastically suddenly and then it's a bit more risky but if you increase it gradually usually it becomes to the point that you have the same amount of money at the end but you have less work so you don't burn out as much at least that's how i kind of handled commissions personally because when i started commissions because i had no experience in them i started at like 10 dollars i think per emote and i had a lot of commissions and i was very happy and i got to learn a lot thanks to that but this was very intense and now i'm glad that i have less <clears throat> Welcome! Uh, oh my god, how do I print this? Mutok Chum. Is it? I forgot if it's Ming? Me? I'm not sure how to print your name. I probably butchered it, but welcome to the stream! Um, yeah. In the end, I talked so much that I didn't even draw. Shame on me. Sorry if my nickname is hard. It's okay, I'm just... Like, I kind of forgot how the Korean alphabet works. <laughs> like, or rather... I, I usually remember some of it, but there are some, some parts that I kind of don't remember as well. So sorry, I probably didn't pronounce it super well. But welcome to the stream nonetheless. But yeah, I think my very, very first commissions were like... I think on DeviantArt, back when it was more uh, used among artists, like around a decade ago. And <laughs> so in DeviantArt, back in the days, I don't know if that's still the case. I know DeviantArt has changed quite a lot since. But back in the days, there was like a virtual currency that's like basically the equivalent of real money in the way that you have to pay to like actually access this unless someone pays you with this but otherwise you don't earn it by like other ways and some people will like commission with like this currency for people that preferred it and actually when you will accumulate those uh this currency that was just called points i think when you accumulate the points you can either like pay with the points with like for a premium subscription on DeviantArt or you could like just literally get like a payout of the money you had which is usually not a lot I mean no actually it's probably a lot it's just that at the time I was tiny so I didn't have a lot of money <laughs> but it was like like I think my first commissions were like in points and I didn't really understand uh the like how much one point was I think one point was like one cent and I charged like, I forgot if I charged 20 points or two, two, 200 and either way, like that means that most my commission was like two euros or at worst it was like 20 cents. <laughs> but yeah, it was not, I don't know. I didn't like this, the point system as much. I think the concept is nice, but for me it was like kind of a pain because I will keep like, 
getting the the amount wrong like the equivalent wrong yeah <clears throat> the square i see luna and while at work is getting smaller i can barely see her now damn i'm back from dinner welcome back i hope the volume is still okay i think it's getting kind of loud now But yeah, it's, it's, um, I forgot what I was trying to say, but it was a different time for sure. And then I don't remember my old prices for commissions, but I mean, probably was not that much. She yawned. Did I? Crap. No. <laughs> No, I yawned potentially. I don't remember. I didn't pay attention, so if I did, it was not even. I didn't even realize it. Pain. Young question mark potential young Schrodinger Schrodinger uh, young. Do you enjoy what you do now? Then you mean commissions? I don't think I. I mean, actually, no, that's not true. I was about to say I don't think I ever disliked doing commissions, and I wouldn't say it ever came to the point of disliking commissions. But I can tell that I was getting. Like, for example, if someone will ask me for, like, changes, it will affect me negatively more. Like, I'll get more tired of commissions and sometimes I'll be, like, not having a good time with some drawings. But no, I'm just, I don't know, I'm, I guess I'm just so grateful that I even get so much work. And the fact that I can, you know, live from that. And usually... Either it's something that I enjoy drawing in the way that Oh yeah, it's a cute anime girl Or it's something that I kind of end up learning from Because it's challenging But then it's like, oh my god, it was an armor And I'm bad at it, but I did it So I think Growing up uh, I developed a better Relationship with like Drawing and commissions Which is good for me Because I have so much right now Huh, maybe I should change this. Oh, maybe I could like make them more on the side like this. Pee pee. Hi, honey. Prince Schrodinger. Right? Yeah, I know. I'm learning German, so I know how pronunciation works. I know English. Is not the best, but somehow I'm getting there in <laughs> other languages. Yippee! Sorry, I don't have the energy to like make it very high. Okay, now I need to draw. Uh, ooh, -hoo, sorry. Uh, to draw two sets of hands for the Carter because she's gonna be clapping. Clappers. <clears throat> Your English is excellent. Aww. Okay, you don't have to lie about this, but thank you. <laughs> thank you for praising my English. But I wouldn't say it's excellent. <laughs> Any clappers in chat? God. Oh. Oh, yeah. Your English is highly above average. Honestly, in a way, I'm kind of like, I kind of hope so, considering like half of the time I speak mostly only English. <laughs> I can clap with one hand, it's like that game. 
The game was so, so, so nice. It's excellent, nevertheless. Aww. Your English is extremely normal. What does that mean? <sighs> oh, hello, camera. Have a nice look. And hello, Kangaroo. That is a yawn. Did I yawn again? Oh my god. I don't, I swear, I don't, I, I genuinely don't even realize it. I'm just so in the moment that I, I don't realize. I realized something about this emote is that I think maybe I need to put it a bit higher because for the clapping maybe it's gonna be a bit like I don't know too I don't even know how I want to do this yay and then this is like scuffs you made yay Da, 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 da. Yeah, actually it kind of works, but I think it would be better if, if the emote was a bit higher. Okay. We good. <clears throat> Don't make me yawn. Sorry. 20 minutes slip is all I got. What? How come? Explain yourself. How come? My brain is not raining. Oh my god. Oh no, what a yell. Mm. I'm not yawning. I will never yawn ever again. Maybe. It's okay, yawn. No! <laughs> My pride is, is in danger right now. Yawn, heavy yawn. No! I refuse. Sometimes it's not like I'm tired or want to yawn. It's just seeing the word yawn makes me want to yawn. You know what I mean? Yawn to see sleepy. Stop. <laughs> I'm trying so hard not to yawn right now, actually. Yippee. Yee uh, I don't, I don't, I don't know about this. I just yawn. It's not like I'm tired or anything. Oh my god. <clears throat> the word yawn makes me want to yawn. I'm glad you're just like me. I had a group project due at 8 a.m. today and finished it at 3 a.m. From there, I had a friend who was working on her project, a friend team, and she was struggling, so I offered to help. That's very kind of you. Oh my god. I will just be like, I'll be dead. I'll be asleep. I, even if I wanted to, I will not be conscious. Ahem. <clears throat> I do feel like you will get more exposure if you stream and do commissions at the same time. You'll be showing off your personality, so less communication, I think. Less communication? How come? But I do agree that streaming is uh, bringing some people uh, commission-wise. Some people discover my art through the streams and yeah. And I can tell that sometimes some people that commissioned me are also to support me because they like the streams and I'm very grateful for that. But yeah, I, 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 it, does, it does help. But you need to make sure that the person is okay with you streaming the commission. Like make sure it's transparent because sometimes they have projects that want to be like a secret until it's revealed. And if you like just stream it without checking with them, then it's like bad communication. I had to wake up at 5 a.m. to go to uni, my goodness. I was humming frequently and saying weird stuff kept me awake. Well, if that helps you. My goodness. I hope the project... Wait, so did you submit it already? I hope that you'll get a good result for it. But God. Oh, thank you for the ugh, saving point. I'll save. I have say thank you. Okay, I need to draw like better hands than this because yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay.
Okay, let's be real. When someone clap, they don't have like their fingers spread like this. It doesn't make sense. So it's like closed like this. passing the exam from last week Yippee! let's go congratulations goodness No, wait, I don't like this at all. Oh my god. This is gonna be hard, actually. I sure I'm slow today. Okay. So, uh... The glow is already there. What, what happened here? Oh my god. Here, I'm gonna, like, put this... Wait. Why is... What is this one? Okay, there's nothing. What about, uh, this? Okay. So I go. <laughs> I'm gonna go to class now. Have a nice rest of your day. Take care. Good luck with class. I feel like the hands on the reference are like very small, like like this. Like honestly, it's like not even Animal Crossing hands. But at the same time, it's not very consistent with my style. So. But it's like wide open and then closing. So this is kind of difficult. Wait, actually this could work. Don't mind the weird line here. This is my pen pressure. My tablet going crazy. And then I will need to just, what the? Rotate this like this yeah that works hey we are getting there double square emoji what what does that mean not anymore oh because you thought it was like a double like the the ones that take more than one emote to like make something together i don't know if that's what you meant sorry it was not that so rectangle oh my god look look at hornet trying to correct correct us let us be wrong we were sleeves in the bottom square ah uh, yeah no i just don't worry Undertale music, yay! Now I'm a man of truth. Damn it. Okay, we have this version. Let's go. This 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 can work. And then we need a wide open one. Honest. <laughs> exactly. Da -da 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 Oh my. Whew. Wait. Maybe? Okay, no, I think the hand can be cute like this. Um... 
Getting nostalgia from the background music. This is such a good track. I'm so glad. Seriously, I, I, I really enjoyed the game and I'm so glad that I didn't get spoiled anything because I didn't play it right at the beginning. Like, I know that the hype was kind of already there. And I feel like it's a miracle that it didn't get spoiled because after playing the game, I will see spoilers everywhere and I'm like, wow. Because I feel like if you get spoiled, well, that's first of all, kind of making the the story, well, y y it's frustrating to get spoiled. So then you kind of like, you, it's not like it's tainting your relationship with the game, but then you, you already go with this kind of better feeling that someone already told you how it goes and this is sad, but also... I feel like this is a game where if you don't discover it by yourself, you kind of... I wouldn't say you lose the, the meaning of the game, but it's definitely more impactful if this is something you discover and you play. <clears throat> for me, surprisingly, I played it after watching gameplays of it. I think if it wasn't for the gameplays, I wouldn't have been interested. I see. I mean, that makes sense. Because, uh, yeah, I can't imagine. But I'm glad I didn't get spoiled. Because I personally enjoy this kind of game in the first place, so I would have liked to play either, either way. So yeah, then I would have been sad to get spoiled. I probably would have still played it, because I agree that this is something like you see the game and you kind of want to experience it. At least in my in my in my opinion, that's probably how I will have felt. But yeah, I stayed up late playing Undertale because I didn't want to go to college. No, I didn't want to do college homework then. Oh God, we've all been there. Right? I remember one specific thing when I played. I remember this was like one time where I was like by myself at home because I think I don't know I think I think I played during you know the um, uh, the holy days like the vacation like school vacation or like work vacation usually there are some in like I think around October and I think it was during that time so like the game has been out for when was the game out again September let me check Undertale release date September, yeah. So I played a month after, and I really saw a lot of people like talking about it at the th at that time. And I remember being by myself, playing it, and like being on my like laptop, like my really bad laptop on my bed. And I remembered at some point grabbing some like I think back then it was Nutella because I was still eating Nutella at the time. Like a jar of it and I, I was just like eating it as I was playing and trying to defeat the boss like some kind of bosses at least I remember the one that marked me but I don't want to like mention it in case some people don't want to know what kind of bosses are around but I don't know why I have quite a vivid memory of this specifically did you defeat the boss I <laughs> feel <laughs> did you defeat the boss Nutella yeah, I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't eat that anymore though, and I don't buy this anymore either. I did that for Breath of the Wild, except I watched some videos, direct videos, one of the best things I did. Ooh, the Nutella boss. The palm oil evil monster. <clears throat> it's funny because I really hate spoilers. I prefer experiencing things first time on my own. Yeah, right, same. <clears throat> Remember when you used to draw from bed? Why did you stop eating Nutella? 
not Nutella. I don't know if you pronounce it that way in other languages, but uh, I don't really consume stuff with palm oil anymore because most of the time it's not really ethically produced. I know that some brands, including Nutella, were like, no, we swear we do it uh, ethically. And then it was proven after that, no, it's still not ethically made. And I can like, kind of live without that, so whatever has palm oil, I don't take anymore. <clears throat> yeah. Remember when you used to draw from bed? Yeah, it was actually, it's thanks to streaming that I don't draw from bed anymore. Like, I used to always draw from my bed back when I had like a, a different kind of tablet and my laptop. And then even when I had my other tab, like my current tablet, which is a screen tablet, I drew from my bed. But then when I tried streaming, my tablet was not strong enough to like stream and have special stuff. So then I eventually, I was interested in a computer, like to stream and do stuff. And that's when I ended up streaming on my desk with my computer. <clears throat> Drawing from bed feels comfortable. Yeah, although it's not really good for your back usually. I mean, I'm saying this, but to be fair, being on the desk with a screen tablet is also not the best, but... <clears throat> mm. I remember the picture of your hand with the case and thumbs up. The case? I have no idea what case you're talking about. <sighs> I don't like you to that too sticky. Computer case? Did I take a picture of this? Remy? I don't even remember. <laughs> oh, wait, was it like on like Instagram stories or something? Cause I feel like I never published this in a permanent thing. I don't remember seeing this, but I might be wrong. I don't remember. <clears throat> Not like it really matters to be fair. Uh, let me check the ref again. Yeah. Maybe you send it to me on DM. Maybe. When do I not thumbs up? I miss, I miss so much cool content by not having Instagram. I haven't like uploaded things on Instagram in ages. Let me tell you. Like the way the platform changed. Like I just don't see myself in it. Like I don't recognize myself. Like you always have to do like it's basically like TikTok. You just have like if you want to be seen, you have to make videos. I don't want to make videos. Like it's if I wasn't already busy with streams and commissions, maybe. But I I don't have time, man. <laughs> I have respect for those that find the time to do it, honestly. Because it's really time consuming. So we have this version, and then we have this version. No, wait, not this. This version. Yay! Yay! Da, 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 da. Wait, can I? I don't know how I can do this. Like, I want to like switch from one to the other. Oh, I kind of feel lazy. Not gonna lie. But I think I think I know how I'm gonna do this. So, don't worry. I got this. So I will make two versions, one version with this eye glow and one version with that eye glow. Wait, which one did I keep again? This one. So this one now. Okay. And then... No, wait, this. <clears throat> Let 
You don't recognize yourself because you look like a 3D flash person instead of a cute purple anime girl. Eh? The way you color emotes is so impressive. Eh? Wait, are you saying this looking at like the older emotes? Because I'm not really coloring today. So I'm... <laughs> so I'm confused. Oh, wait, here. Here, oh god, thank god, okay. Here we go. I'm so confused. Her coloring has always made me mesmerized. Really hope to reach her level one day. I'm sure again, it's really not that hard. Like, especially for emotes, it's so simple. Like, trust me, it's easy. I think most people can do it. So you don't recognize yourself was because you said you don't recognize yourself on Instagram. And yes, the comment about emote coloring was in reference to the other ones. But why are you saying I'm not an anime girl? I'm... I am an anime girl. Like, are you not watching the stream? How dare you accuse me of being real. It's kind of rude. <laughs> okay, here. So now we have those two that are done. And then I need to make new emotes that are just like in their own canvases for animation most people are putting too much hope on us humans now i swear it's just it's really simple like most of the coloring is is really like it's not really much work it's like you know like you want to color this you want to color the skin after putting like a base color then you just add like wherever you want the shadows to be okay it's not supposed to be purple for the most part but imagine you do this and then you turn like the edges into something lighter like it's a gradient and then it makes it a bit softer and then you just add blush if you want but otherwise it's mostly how the coloring works it's just there's not much more going on <clears throat> I meant you don't recognize yourself on Instagram because you look... There you look flesh, fake, not real, and then on Twitch you look like an anime god, real the truth. I'm still a bit confused, but that's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Okay. <clears throat> Emotes colors have so much texture and such though. Most emotes I see are much flatter colors. Really? Cause I, I I feel like there's really not much going on. That's why I, I'm saying that this is probably easy to do for everyone, because there's really not much going on in the coloring for like pretty much anything regarding emotes, which Probably cool. Ah. Ah. Oh my god, okay, that one I can deny was a yawn. But well, I'm glad you like my emotes. Whether I I I I I I agree to your praises or not. I appreciate it, thank you. Uh what are the other two emotes? Okay, the the glow stick one? Was it a real yawn? No, I was actually faking it so I could make everyone tired on stream. I never yawn on purpose or I mean, no, I never yawn um, really. I, I always pretend. So then you can be like, oh my god, she's just a sleepy anime girl. But no, I'm evil and I'm trying to make everyone fall asleep on my stream. Fake yawn. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> so, glue sticks. Yay. 
actually I'm so not gonna have fun with this because it's gonna be layered but I'm gonna have to put like an additional difficulty okay an additional difficulties in, in layered emotes is when the hair is like when the the character has a hood on a hoodie like like this it's so it's not enjoyable to say the least it's it's i mean it looks like the, this is a good design choice but as the person that makes the emotes for the layering it's usually painful but that's okay it's only two emotes i'll be fine i'll maybe cry a little bit but uh, this too shall pass i'm getting paid for this so if luna was a vi villain she will fail miserably with her evil love no you don't get it like this is this is this is this is again because i want you guys to think i'm a failure okay so i'm pretending to be a gremlin or whatever sometimes but in fact my evil laugh is like terrifying but this is not time to show it like why would i show my real evil laugh for the matter of just someone sleeping do you think it's worth it i don't think so she trips on her evil cape and fails fails well learn to type first honey then you can talk also i don't have an evil cape why would i need an evil cape just my presence is is, is 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 evil enough. Not like I can expect you guys to understand. <laughs> Whatever. I am on 20 minutes of sleep. Yeah, but you're, you're too confident for someone on 20 minutes of sleep. <laughs> Leave me alone. <laughs> you just, just survive on my stream and roast me for no reason. She trips on nothing. Shut up. Don't talk to me. Don't talk to me. Don't don't talk. Actually, just just don't. It's time to to to, to mute the whole chat. Emotes only. <clears throat> I am always confident. Well, you shouldn't be. See the mistake you just made. I don't like this. <laughs> I feel a bit lazy today, not gonna lie. <sighs> Why is Hone on uh, 20 minutes of sleep? Because Hone doesn't have the best organization skills. Hone is a professional procrastinator. Not really professional because it's not like they're paid for it, but. You know what I mean. Hone used to tell me to sleep. Hone always tells people to sleep, but like is the one that needs to sleep the most, I swear. Like Hone tells me to sleep sometimes, but Hone is in the time zone that's later than my own. So yeah. Don't 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 tell me what to do. At least Hone gets a job done. I, I guess a job done too, okay? <laughs> I just fall into despair. Maybe that's your job. You just don't know it yet. Oh, send her. Hilly, go sleep at midnight her time. When my time is like 3 a.m. Yeah, see? I'm home. Hi, Kyle! Oh my god, Kyle, you were the first chatter today. But I didn't see how early you, you, you wrote like an emote in the chat but i was wow wow but yeah welcome home uh well i need to do something because right now this is just a blank canvas this is kind of sad to just show this um let me see something <sighs> so 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 I believe finished emotes. Wait, the song is so good. Oh yeah, I have it. Okay. I was like 8.40 for me. Oh, okay, okay. I was not sure when it was. Hmm. <clears throat> 
Then I had to go for an errand every time. What song is this? I know this song, but I forgot where I know it. Let me let me tell you though. Oh, it's from Xenoblade Chronicles. Let me uh, send you the specific track. Here. I don't know why it says GE. And the playlist for those that are interested is this will be verse chi banish be chi arrive now it will be chi appear probably no well not really but well whatever wait did i okay this is fine this is fine new emotes not really oh i mean new emote commissions yeah new emotes reveal on the stream no Imagine having time to do your own streaming stuff. Ha <laughs> ha! <clears throat> anyway. <laughs> My life is sad. Mm okay, so, the emote. It's okay, Hilly. It's fine. It's fine! It's fine! I mean, we don't have... Honestly, it's not just... It's not just the lack of time, it's also kind of not really know how, knowing how to organize this. There was like a topic on Discord which was about potentially moving some BTTV emotes to the new slots we got on Twitch because maybe I do want to add the Luna ones into like the regular chat after all. I think it would be nice to be able to use them outside of this channel. But... <sighs> In the end, we never really fully came into a conclusion of those things. Like, there was a debate and then, like, we just kind of never confirmed anything. So I kind of don't even know what to do. <laughs> yeah. <clears throat> but also, yeah, it's also organizing which emotes get moved to like twitch emotes and like twitch channel emotes rather and what potentially will be new stuff if people want new stuff like because in the list of people that choose stuff it's not necessarily the right amount so i don't know i love to use those around hmm wouldn't that sleepy is so me how come c c Nilsh? I don't know if it's Nilsh or Nilsh in your case, but probably Nilsh. How come? Oh, change, break pad change. This thing only needs to be probably clean and it's good to go. Oh yeah, you said you said you were working on a bike, right? That seems satisfying. Yippee. Yippee! 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 This is I love as well. Auto work is really satisfying when it goes smoothly. Did you? Did you do that before? Is this something you have experience in, perhaps? If we had a Yippee counter, it will reach more counters and hits within two years. I don't know if it's something worth counting though. Like, I feel like if I had a Yippee comment, it would just be the bot replying Yippee or something. <laughs> like, is there is there a point in counting a Yippee? Like, I don't know. <clears throat> Am I a mechanic? Not very good, but I do fix most issues on my car. Wow, that's really impressive. God, it's so crazy for me to realize that people have cars. Like, you guys have like things. Like, you have work. You, you can drive. You have a car. You have a house. Like, that's always crazy for me to realize. It's like, wow, people are like settled. 
and their lives and stuff kind of or not really but still it's like wow they're like they, they, they look like responsible adults that's so impressive <laughs> i can't drive <laughs> and i'm like 86 i wish i was that old i have a car i'm responsible <laughs> Yeah, no, okay, you guys never sleep, so you're not really responsible. I'm an adult. But you know what I mean? I think, maybe. <clears throat> Sadly, I live in a place where personal cars aren't practically needed. It's not very walkable here. Ah, that makes sense. Actually, oh yeah, that reminds me that lately I've been thinking about trying to, like, not get my driving license, but learn the theory part, right? Because usually you need to get the theory part down first, and then you can try to learn to ride a car and then try to pass your driving license. Lately, I've been thinking of potentially trying to pass the theory stuff. Like, I don't really need it per se, because I, wherever I live, whenever I move, it's always very close to, like public transportation and it's not really convenient to even have a car where i live but i feel like it will be useful if people need me you know like i don't know i don't know if i will do it though but i've been thinking about it lately it's just so expensive to freaking pass the thing like i don't want to put like four digits into learning and passing this for something i don't actually need but at the same time, when I'll be, cause you know how I keep moving back and forth in different countries. I should learn this while I can still go to my home country because one day I'll probably be like settled in another one. And then it will be more difficult to pass it because it's gonna be more expensive or a different language. Meanwhile, if I do it in a more familiar place, it's gonna be probably easier. Can you use your driving license across Europe, by the way? I think it depends. Like, some countries accept a driving license from other countries and some don't. I think from the EU, it probably works. The rest of Europe, I don't know. I know that for... Uh, I know that for... Like, the United States, it depends. Because when I was in Seattle, I was considering it because apparently it was pretty cheap to pass it there. But... I think the state of Washington, like, a, a permit there wouldn't be valid in, like, I think where I live or something. A cheap skate? Yo, this is like, four digits. If you have four digits to spare, spend it here on the channel. <laughs> but no, yeah. Four digits? You didn't know? At least in my country, it's easily four digits if you want to learn, like, the theory and the passing the, the license and stuff. That's why I don't want to do it. It's so... It's, it's like, I don't want to spend that much money for something I don't need. That's a new VTuber model. Yeah. Like, if you don't need it, 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 it doesn't make you want to pass it. Four digits seems a bit much. Right? It is, it is a lot. Even without any addiction, it's still difficult to save enough, right? Right? Let me check. Maybe it's different now. Let me let me check. Yeah, it can be over one thousand two hundred euros. <laughs> oh my god. Yikes. And from the other thing, they say that minimum is like 600. That's still a lot. Like, if you don't want to use it, you don't want to spend like six, 600 for no reason, right? But yeah, it can go up to... They say 1,200 for a first, like, signing up to, like, to, to learn to, like, you know, getting, like... It's not like an internship, but you know what I mean? And then, if you fail, you still have to pay an extra 300 to keep learning and stuff. This is... Oh my god. Apparently, on average this year, the prices to pass the theory and the license cost 1,800 euros! 
just for the test now i think it's also to get like the theory like because you have to go to a school this is so this is so much you understand now why i can drive <laughs> i'm crying i'm not crying as you can hear but i'm crying on the inside and that's a vtuber model and a chibi model no that's 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 just a vtuber model with the current with the current things actually a lot of models are more expensive than this i learned to drive with 350 euros i wish that were me but it's not uh public transport in europe is good right yeah that's why in my case like i'm close to stations and stuff well it's good more or less some parts are not good some parts are good <clears throat> Spent extra on f 50 extra on two lessons I needed. That's so little. I'm so jealous. <laughs> but yeah, that's why I feel like I don't need it. I feel like if I really, obviously, if I didn't have like easy access to public transportation, probably I will have learned it still because you know I need to not walk to go to like, like you know like 100 kilometers away. But man, <laughs> that's that's so much. Pain. <clears throat> Thank you for the redeems, by the way, please. How come you're still awake? Aren't you asleep at the time usually? Theory costs 10 euros here. Okay, stop rubbing it. Okay, like, I'm already sad that I have to pay that much. Okay. <laughs> but yeah. To be fair, it's not just like to pass it, it's also because usually you have to go to some schools. Like for theory, I think you have to sign up with a school, so you pay the price. And I think that's kind of the same for driving as well, for the most part. So that's that's not just passing technically, but still, that's that, 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 usually that's the price that is put there because it's, I think, if I recall correctly, Instead of having to go to a school to learn how to drive after you get the theory down, you can have someone that drives with you if they're willing to, if they have their license for over five years and like they have to fill some papers and stuff. It's kind of still some work and stuff. So yeah. The theory should be easy since it's multiple choice questions. Uh... Six euros. Oh my god. I'm so jealous. <laughs> I'm so jealous. But well, I mean, you know, good for you. I think I think it should be affordable. I think like the fact that it's so expensive is not normal. So good for you for having like a cheap uh way of passing your license in the theory. I think I think this should be the norm. Oh my god, this is gonna be kind of difficult to do because there are gonna be like arms here, but because the because of how the torso is gonna be, it might be a bit difficult. But yeah, that's why though I'm still thinking about it. Like I, I I'm considering it, but I'm not fully decided on it yet. But to be honest, I shall decide soon because I regularly move back and forth, country wise. So. I should, I should, if I like decide to pass the theory, I should try to pass it before uh, I, I move again. So I should, I should decide soon. Time to say good night, good night, Luna. Gonna chat. I mean, it's, it's fine. You, you are allowed to say chat. It's technically also a valid thing. <laughs> but thank you for passing by. Also, this music that was playing right before was one of my favorite Pokemon tracks. I wanna play star you. Q 
you, Chibi. Thank you. How's it? What? Motor motorbike licenses are around 200 for the unlimited one. Unlimited? Oh, does it mean that there are some licenses where like you have to like pass it again after a while? Like only for like five years or something? The unlimited one means you can drive. Oh, the 400. I don't know what CC means actually. Enabled. Stardew. Oh! Stardew is nice. I like Stardew. I wanna play. Maybe I'll play later today. And for this means that I have to be productive today. So I have less work to do after the stream. My new motivation just dropped. And look at me suddenly being faster. <laughs> me realizing work awaits and Stardew too. I am a changed person now. Look at her go! Let's go! <laughs> Here we go! I love this, this, this pun. I swear. Like, I want this to be a, a common chant in the stream when, like, people are cheering for me. Here we go! Here we go! <laughs> This makes me happy. Just realized that the hoodie might be okay after all. Like there is more difficult stuff. I can probably make it work without suffering too much. <clears throat> it's 20 lessons of one hour, 5 theory lessons. Wait, then it's like 5 theory lessons and 15 for driving? Damn. I, I heard that passing the driving, at least the theory, is much easier nowadays though. Hi, Kettle! Welcome to the stream. Oh, 20 driving and 5 theory. How are you, Kettle? I think in like I heard because like I told like I think a sibling about this and they were like oh don't worry it's so much easier nowadays back in my days it was more difficult blah 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 in the way that back then apparently you will have to go through like a lot of theory lessons and then when they see that you don't make too many mistakes they will uh make you pass like basically as if you were passing the theory like to actually get the like it I don't know if you call this a diploma, but you know, but it's just like a mock-up exam basically and then when you do it well a few times Potentially then you can pass the theory so it takes ages But apparently now it's much easier and you can kind of just do it on your own because a lot of things are online thanks to COVID Or rather the impact that COVID had So yeah, maybe someday <clears throat> First, it's a 40 question questionnaire. If you do two wrongs, you need to redo the lesson. Understandable. Like, I feel like for theory, for something as important as driving, it makes sense that they're gonna be picky about it because driving is like so important, right? Like, if you make mistakes, you can literally kill someone. So, like, I, I think it's fair that they will be like, not very forgivable if you make mistakes but yeah it really is important yeah i wonder if i ever pass my li license i wonder what kind of driver i will be i wonder if i will be because i have some people i know that are just like really stressed driving uh, like they don't like it they just feel the pressure because you know like you you can kill someone and like you have such a car you know i wonder if i'll be like that i join and she's just yapping is that what you're saying i'm just talking i'm scared of driving understandable i have a friend that literally got like 
kind of it's not really carpool tuna i think but something equivalent to it because one time she had to drive uh in the capital and the capital oh my god driving at, in the capital is such an experience apparently according to everyone i know and she was so tense driving there that she literally like got something like that like just from being so tense that's so sad in a way <clears throat> i will never call you lunacy yappy why is this bad i don't know if yapping is supposed to be a bad word like or you know like because i know it's used a lot nowadays to say that you talk a lot but i don't know if this is actually like bad i just thought it was to, to say talking a lot capital over here is bad traffic too yeah like seems crazy <clears throat> in a good way though you need to be careful mm -hmm. the only frustrating thing can be parking during rush hours Hmm. I have like someone I know that is like just they hate parking just in general I guess having to like do the backward thingy must be stressful potentially it's not bad I think the connotation of that word is bad well I think if people tell me this I, I think it depends on how it's said I guess but I won't put probably won't take it bad i think it depends probably i don't know <clears throat> yeah oh one sec One moment, I need to do something. Okay. Mm, I need to get back to my art practice. Can I neglect the grind. Good luck with your work. Thank you. Take care. <clears throat> if I came in and said, Oh my gosh, she won't stop yapping, that would be a bit mean. Yeah, because, like, you know, it's my stream. So then that will be kind of like, well, you know. <laughs> I think it, yeah, I think it depends on how it's said, probably. Or how... I think it also depends on who the person is who says it. Like, if it's someone that is new and the first thing they say is like, Oh my gosh, she won't stop shutting up. That that, that will be... Like, she, no, she won't shut up. That is kind of, you know, like, um... Who are you? <laughs> Individual. But for the other, like if it's like, I don't know, she won't stop shutting. <laughs> I can't speak, okay? Don't be mean. Mm. <clears throat> but yeah. <laughs> God, I can't, I can't even get my point across because I just say the opposite thing. God. <clears throat> she just seemed very fired up about the driving topic. Yeah, I was talking about how I was like considering passing the theory part, but at the same time, I don't know if I want to. Like, I don't know if I'm ready for it because passing the driving license in my country, in the forbidden country, is really expensive. It's like four digits, and I don't want to like spend four digits if I'm not gonna really have a use for it, if that makes sense. But yeah. 
And then we were talking about, I think, other things. I don't remember. Jesus. Yeah. It's expensive, isn't it? That's why. That's why I can drive. That's why I'm in pain. I was. I checked. Because I remember hearing this. So I checked online when I was like talking about it on stream. And it's like, you can start at 600, but usually it goes up to... Well, it's weird because one side says it can be uh, up to uh, 1200 and if you don't pass it, you pay 300 extra for your complimentary lessons. So it's quite a lot. And another site, which I think is like from the government side or something, said that on average right now, people spend 8 1500 to pass the driving license and i'm just sad <clears throat> if you have good public transit available i wouldn't bother getting it especially not if you live in or around a major city yeah that's why i haven't done that up until now but i don't know i've seen some people around me able to drive and this made me think i also realized because i keep moving back and forth in different countries i should try to do it one like while I'm in the forbidden country because otherwise I will I will struggle because it will be like more expensive in a different country or at least what I'm assuming because my the other country I'm usually at is expensive for no reason and also the language difference makes it difficult and eventually I will probably settle in, in a different country so I feel like I should do this while I can still be in the forbidden country but at the same time it's so much money <clears throat> it's 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 she's flexing on the rest of us non-travelers again don't get it wrong like if i if i didn't ha like if i could settle in and not have to move all the time i would <laughs> i don't do it because i find it fun but yeah um but yeah, it's also realizing that there will be times where I could help, like, I don't know, people by knowing how to drive. And, I don't know, not knowing how to makes me feel useless sometimes. So yeah. But at the same time, I'm not really decided on doing this, but I've been thinking about it. It's, uh, it's like, I'm, I'm, I'm com it's complicated. <clears throat> Why do you move so much? Are you hiding from someone? Yeah, I, I keep committing crimes, so I have to remove countries so they don't catch me, basically. You, you got me. Okay, then I need the hand that grabs the thing. Let me one sec. And looks a bit weird. Okay. <clears throat> Bees fugitive on the run, drawing B sketches for a premium. Tickets are expensive. <laughs> 
Philly should be the new title. Maybe, you know what? Well, I'm not drawing sketches tomorrow, I think, but uh, next stream, I can, I can do something. But then people are gonna think this is my stream concept and they're gonna be like, oh my God, what's your lore? And I'm, I would be like, no, it's my life. And then it's kind of weird. It's a tricky situation. Okay, this and then she could also give herself one of those uh, 1930s outfits. Make the stream black and white. Wait, what's the mobster outfit? Let me check. It'll be Ken because the dwarves dug too deep and greedily. What's a mob? Wait, let me let me try. I can't do this. It's easy to set the stream in black and white. Oh, this! My God, I love suits. Let's go. I want. I want a suit, and I want to be cool. suit you haha <laughs> get it suit <sighs> yeah haha <laughs> <laughs> yeah <laughs> I mean that was well thought of <laughs> don't worry it wasn't it wasn't as bad as I pretend it was don't worry you, you're fine Oh, Kettle, you're so funny. I know, right? It's like such a comedy genius. I'm impressed. Okay, so this will be something like that. Uh, I need to just hide some versions. So this version has this hidden... Woohoo! Wait. Wait. How would this work? Like this? Yeah. Like this. Okay, and then this gets hidden. Okay. And then. Uh, I need to copy paste this too. Something like that somehow. And uh, this will be like this. Wait, that doesn't make sense. No, wait, I think I can. Okay. And then. Okay, well, I will make it work. I need to go, but I love the mood here. Thank you for the stream. Bye, everyone. Thank you. Uh, I'll. I forgot. I'll. Ka. Tat. Wait, no. Wait. I. I. Ah. Uh, what was it? Um. Alcatraz. Yeah. I was like, where's the R? I remember there's an R, but I forgot. Okay. Thank you for passing by. Glad you had a nice time. All right here I am so not convinced actually by this uh maybe wait maybe I have an idea 
Uh, but then I would need to do this. I know this is scuffed, but that's how it is, I guess. Okay. And then... Like, I want to make... The, the hands and stuff more visible. Oh, I think this is better that way. Yippee! Yoohoo! Wow! Okay. Um, I might actually edit things a bit on Clip Studio Paint to make the face a bit smaller. But for now, I'm gonna save this. Emote.mpish. Oh, I forgot to save it as number one. Because I have a second one. The second one should be easy, though, I think. I hope. Hopefully. one the reference was sent to me to this and okay it's pretty simple i mean kind of simple it's like one character with like uh a, a car a car uh how do you call this a car wheel not the, the wheel like the, the wheel to drive how do you call this i don't even know let me check i think it's written uh it's called the steering wheel yeah this exactly it's basically gonna be a similar emote i think as the one you just sent i think i don't even know if it's like sweating i think it is actually actually i don't know well and either way it's supposed to be chaotic the same way so yeah um yeah And I'm just gonna make a quick sketch to figure out how I want to make things. Have a nice little Connie. But this should be more in the front view. Mm. 
but then maybe that will mean that the character needs to be in the front view as well so i need to see No wait, this is the other way. Okay. So I'm gonna I'm gonna hide the hand for now. Here we go. is done this one i might just like try to improve just simple parts of the face so that it's kind of even cute you like to see despair this is someone suffering and and and, and that's that's how you think it's cute is that it <laughs> i see So I'll save this emote adventure two, and I'm gonna, um, I'm gonna. Oh shoot! I'm gonna just do the change that I mentioned on um, Clip Studio Paint, but I can probably show that actually. Mm. So where is it? Uh. Emote cut MP two. No wait, that was the no, number one that I need. Actually, maybe I'll change the number two. But emote cut MP one. All right. Uh, here I just need a white background for the reference, but but I want the face to be a bit smaller. Yay! 
Yeah, I think I prefer it that way. Yeah, I think this is better that way. So I can save this. And then the other one will be pretty simple. Oh, oops. But I do want to potentially move stuff. Like, wait, this is maybe not a good idea. No, actually, I think it's better. Okay. <clears throat> oh, wait, let me remove this. Okay, so that was the, the sketches I wanted to work on today. Um, <sighs> I think outside of that, the other stuff I have to work on are gonna be for another day, looking at the time, because we have around 30 minutes left, but the rest will be, um, how should I say this? It will be bigger steps, so I don't want to start that on stream today. Um... But we're gonna work on those bigger things tomorrow on stream. And tomorrow what we're gonna work on will most likely be uh, some more emotes. I think I have a lot of emotes for a while actually. Yeah, I think most of my emotes, uh, commissions are emotes. Oh no, I know what I forgot to do. Okay, no wait, there's still something. I lied. I forgot, but now I remember. We good. Oh, I'm glad. I kinda, I'm glad to find out that I forgot something, so we don't have to end too early. Okay, we're returning to Clip Studio, and I'm gonna... I have a chibi commission to draw as well, that I kind of forgot about. So, we'll do this. I even got like a little pose. I got confirmed, so I just have to recreate this. I'm probably gonna use the symmetrical ruler for at least the pose. Uh, here. Was it this? Yes. All right. Let's go. Okay, so that one is not a. Uh, how should I say this? It's not a. No, wait, that's way too many things. It's not. <laughs> it's not um, a new mode, but I'm excited to work on this nonetheless. Draw the face shape around it. Wait, maybe I will enjoy drawing with this more.
a VTB2, yeah. It is. Basic. Also, thank you, Kaya, for the 18 months. My god, 18. I'm old enough to drink now. Not quite. Actually, doesn't it depend on places? Like, and isn't it in the state? Like, in some countries, it's like 20 or 21, right? So, not in UK, it is 18 months confirmed. Drink moderately if you do, it's important. <laughs> but yeah, the way you draw hair is really cool. Thank you, I'm glad you think so. I'm not very confident, but I'm glad you like it. months old same as florida what <laughs> what don't worry about it i do i do worry a little I am slightly concerned by the statement. Is this is this a statement to say that in Florida people drink really really young? Um. <clears throat> hello Siku. Hello. Uh, Ilk. How are you both? Welcome to the stream. I'm gonna redo the years. Well, how are you? I am! Why is Siku crying? <laughs> it. Here. Alright. I shouldn't have a knowledge their existence. <laughs> oh, people are so foolish. Almost two years old and then it was over. Well they deserved it. It's on them. 
I do not feel bad. <sighs> All right. Okay, I want to still do. I'm kind of like still conflicted with this chibi chibi honest. Like, I kinda. Maybe it's because I'm not super used to using the um, symmetrical ruler. But I'm like trying to figure out how I can do things. Something cute is that on top of the carter, there's supposed to be the mascot like sitting on top of it. I think it's gonna be cute if I do it well. Can you really call yourself a regular if you haven't been timed out at least 17 times? Is that how many times you've been timed out, Kettle? How many times? I can- I can see it. Oh my god. Oh my god, no. I think it's more- it's- it's 51. <laughs> Okay, I, I, I figured it would be maybe more, but I didn't think it would be like that much more. Oh my god. <laughs> Goodness. Ah, Waffle, hello, thank you for the redeems. <clears throat> the souls you can't get rid of me that easily. No, I mean, you know, if I need, I can just ban you permanently. Don't worry. <sighs> Hello, how is everyone doing today? Hello, I'm doing well. I will uh, do the redeems. One sec. What kind of chibi was it again? Uh, one sec. Uh, I just need to make sure I know what style this is. Why are you confused? Why do you seem so lost? This is, yeah. Uh, wait, a simple coloring? Okay. Vampy. And then. Wait! Is this a. Is this actually one? I feel like I'm accidentally putting something else. One sec. Oh, it's a cell shading. Oh my god, I almost made a mistake. Okay, cell shading, that's what I thought. Cell shading. Vampy. Hey. Um. Okay, here. Kyle, I can see how many times you've been timed out. And it's only been four times. It's, it's pretty. I mean, this is not me encouraging you, though, but yeah. <sighs> Goodness. That's no. Let's not change it. Don't make me time you out. I will be sad. You don't want to make a cute enemy girl sad, right? Yeah, you have more decency than that, right? Think about it. Like, yeah, you get a timeout, but at what cost? Then I will hate you. <clears throat> Think about it. But yeah. <sighs> oh, I think the hair has flowers. Yeah, I need to draw flowers too. So let's do this. But maybe the flowers won't be symmetrical, so at least it's a bit more. Uh, very, uh, like, divers. Yippee! Okay. I'm kind of not convinced by this so far, by the way. Like, I, I don't really know where I'm going with this, but I'm not, I'm not sure I'm happy with the outcome. Mm. Yeah. 
but back to the topic of like you know wanting to be timed out and stuff i don't think that's what you meant but in general i feel like if people try to like mess up with my rules or my boundaries proposally to get a timeout because it's fun for them for me it's just really sad like because it's just not fun it's just disrespectful so i've already said this pretty vocally before but as fun as you think this is please don't try to be like time out just for the sake of it because i think i will just eventually ban you oh no yeah i mean thinking about it I mean, I understand why some people think it's funny to be timed out because there's like, kind of some weird... I don't know if it's like a culture from streaming about it, but yeah. But if you, if you, if you, if you try to like, break the rules to do this, then it's just like, the rules are not there so you don't get timed out, like it's there because usually the streamer is uncomfortable with this, right? Or that doesn't that, doesn't that makes them unhappy so if you try to like trigger this on purpose it's really yeah it's disrespectful so yeah i've said this many times and i guess i'll have to keep saying it but for real please don't do that it genuinely makes me sad um <laughs> hi otto how are you? Being understandable. <laughs> My condolences. I should make the head bigger this time, actually. <laughs> Funny how I just had to decrease the the size and then now the work for the same character. But then this is supposed to be- Oh my god, no, okay, not, not that way. <laughs> god. Okay, maybe more like this? And then we have the mascot on top of it, but I kind of want to uh, um, Just just kind of like how, should, how to say this Improve the shoes Cause it's, it's a bit messy right you now Nice drawing, thank you! Welcome to the stream. Super deformed the deformed. Yeah, whatever that means. <laughs> 
what is this thing? It's for the sleeves. Okay. Mm. The sleeves go like this. Oh, shoot, wait, forgot that I had the signature calls really. Okay, <clears throat> and then... It's close. TB is also known as super deformation. Oh yeah, true. It's like SD. I remember. Okay. <clears throat> and then. Wait, I think the commissioner will want to like that's more like this. Okay, and then the mascot that I think is sitting on top. I just want to make sure that's how it goes. Uh, chibi, chibi, chibi. Chibi. Sitting, yeah. Oh god. Actually, though, in a as a um, as a symmetrical thing, it should be not too difficult. Okay.
I'm gonna decrease this a bit. And then decrease this as well. There we go. And then we have the sketch. Hopefully that's okay. Alright, so then that's it for the daily sketches. <clears throat> oh god, okay, wait one sec. Here, blah blah blah. Alright, <clears throat> so uh, I'm gonna find someone to raid for the rest of the day. And tomorrow. Tomorrow. Thank you, Kyle. Uh, tomorrow. Tomorrow. Sorry, I'm all over the place. Tomorrow I'll be, uh, yeah, uh, working on more emotes that are already, uh, sketched. So it will be like finishing emotes. Probably. I don't know how it's gonna go. Cause it's only two standard emotes, which then is usually pretty quick to do. But then, oh god, I just realized the alert is just Kyle. Like, it's not even saying what Kyle did, it's just Kyle. <laughs> Kyle existed. But yeah, uh, but I don't know how it's gonna go, because uh, the other stuff are like layered emotes, but I don't think I'll have time to work on them, or at least go far with them, so I guess we'll see. Wait, what? Yeah, look at the recent activity, like, at the bottom of the screen. Like, usually it's, like, name and then, like, thing that they did. Like, you know, sub, resub, raid. But this time it's just Kyle. <laughs> the recent activity is just the fact that you existed. I wonder why. Maybe it's because their name is on the longer side? I don't know. I feel like that's the first time I noticed this, so I'm a bit surprised. <laughs> Imagine only Kyle. Well, no need to imagine it because it's right there. So, um, I'll be looking for someone to raid. I'll be back tomorrow in the morning this time. Sorry, I wanted to stream this morning as well, but because of the vet appointment, uh, that didn't work out. But tomorrow it will work out, and Thursday as well. Uh, <laughs> Alright, who shall we raid today? Um, mm, 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 mm. I'm looking, I'm looking. I'm looking. <clears throat> Thank you for this stream. Thank you for passing by and chatting with me and, and everything. Ooh. Oh my god. I think I know who this person is. Okay, I may be wrong, but I think I found someone in my recommendations that is someone who's working i think it's kind of like potentially concept art and it seems to be cat and tea related and this reminds me that someone once raided us and did like a cafe or a tea shop uh that was cat themed and showed us and it was really cool and i think it might be this person so i'll be happy to raid them and support them again and also it looks really cool so it's not necessarily you know cute anime girls and stuff but it's really really cool to watch i really am fascinated by this so i would love to support them all right let's try to raid them Vyuki is their name or Vyuki? Vyuki? i don't know okay the channel is intended for mature audiences so if there are any underage people watching today's stream please be wise and do not attend the stream of the person we we're gonna raid as Alex put in the comments, we have the rate messages if you want to take part of it. Um, the first one is for subscribers and the second one has free emotes. Yeah. And I'll be back tomorrow for more emote art. Make sure to check. Uh, well, they don't, yeah. They don't actually have uh, channel rules, but just be respectful and... If you're not sure what the boundaries are, just ask or avoid it because we don't want to make people uncomfortable. Just be really supportive of their art and, and yeah. Take care of yourself and have a good rest. See you tomorrow. See you. Thank you for passing by today. I'll be back tomorrow. Bye-bye. Wow, the stream ended. Wow.